Hello again, everyone. Welcome to the 200 subscriber special. I just want to take a moment to thank all of you for helping me get this far. Really, you... I... I I'm speechless. <laughs> really, I'm speechless. Alright. Well, I've received some questions from all of you on YouTube and on Discord. And today, we're going to answer them. Percent Chen has two questions for me. How much sleep do you get? Note, please do get some proper rest if you don't get enough. And what's your typing speed? I get sleep. <laughs> okay, so on a good day, um, a day where I don't have to worry about extra stuff, I can get about 8 to 10 hours sleep easy. However, I am a night owl, and I tend to stay up pretty late a lot at night, which usually leads to having a few days where I only get 4 to 6 hours sleep, you know, when I have to go do other things. I'll try to fix this, but I doubt it's going to be for a while. As for your second question, well, I actually had to go and check. I didn't think it would be that fast, but I actually got 44 words per minute. The test claimed I was an octopus. <laughs> I honestly have never thought of myself as that fast of a typer. But after spending years on the internet typing up documents for college and what have you, I suppose I learned a few things about typing. I don't really use all my fingers, though. I have certain default fingers that I just use over and over. Weird how that works. Red Apple asks two questions as well. Exactly how many memes do you have? And who drew your profile picture? Well, last I checked, I saved about 2,000 plus images. Granted, I haven't saved any recently and I'm organizing them all into folders now because, well, 2,000 images is a lot to sort through. <laughs> If I want to find one image, I'm not able to really find it, unless I keep scroll and scroll for hours, you know? Regarding your second question, a friend of mine drew it for me. She loved my stuff and wanted to contribute, and I can't personally thank her enough. It looks great. Oh, and if you're watching the video, thanks. If you like the art style, I'll be sure to leave a link and any social media she has in the description. Liz asks me a series of questions. <laughs> oh, wow. How is your day? Can I live under your bed? Are there any new series you have in mind? Take responsibility, sir. You made me procrastinate almost every day because of that one question, good boy audios or good boy audios. And can I steal your voice acting skill? I can trade you my ankle for it. To answer your first question, I'm feeling pretty great, and I hope you're all feeling the same. To answer your second question, why would you want that? It's very uncomfortable on there, trust me, I know. To answer your third question, well, kind of. You'll be seeing a lot more of that universe that I mentioned last time in more of my role plays for sure. There are still a lot of stories, and I mean a lot of stories, that I look forward to sharing with all of you. And more soon to come, I'm sure. For your fourth question, well, <laughs> I certainly don't want any of you suffering because of something I said. <laughs> Alright, the correct way to say it is... Hope that clears things up for you. And your final question, I think you might need your ankle. Just a hunch. And I certainly have no need for a third ankle. But I'm sure with practice you'll be just as good if not better than I at voice acting. Keep at it, my friend. Finally, we have a question from the Shy One VA who asks, Do you cringe at your own voice when you record audios? Actually, I used to. When I was but a lad, I listened to my voice on a recording device and thought, Wow, I hate this. <laughs> to be completely honest with you, that feeling never really goes away. Then one day, I got a software setup that lets me hear myself through my microphone onto my headphones, and I use it whenever I speak online. This way I could get used to the sound of my own voice and not hate myself as much. <laughs> right, well, that's all the questions we have. But... That isn't the only thing we have this week. I've decided that for Halloween, we will have a special ASMR roleplay in celebration of the season. So, look out for that on the 31st. I hope you all enjoy it. And thank you once again for 200 subscribers. Here's to 200 more.